welcome back to our everyday living everyone I'm back here at good old Harvey Norman to pick up all of these printers and God knows what there's a fair bit of stainless steel in them that I I reckon I could pull out and the power supplies all that sort of thing um, and all the wire so I've got to be careful about this because they've spilt ink like in you seen one of my other videos where big ass printer I'll say it's a big ass printer because it was a big printer um, they'd sp spilt all the ink over it and yeah they made a mess in here so I'm going to load this all in the car at the moment and uh, yeah because there's a bit of steel there so that's a bit of scrap steel I'll take everything not too worried if it's all smashed up I just hope I can fit everything. I'll take everything out of here. Unfortunately, I've got to take it all. Glass included. Phone's ringing. It can wait. When is it not ringing? Always ringing. It never stops. So zinc cartridges, so I've got to be careful about those. Motor in that. Oh dear, that's got some weight in it. Leave it there. Right, now this doesn't look like there's anything wrong with it. I might sit that one in the front. <sighs> the devil is that. That'd have a little power supply in it. Phone cords. 
Bit of steel in that. Not much. Pretty much slim pickings when you're getting into that stuff. Yeah, I'll take the modem too. A bit there. Take that. Plastic with me. I've got enough to process it. Wait to it. Take that. Hey, that might work. Put that in the pocket. I'll be happy about this. They've been waiting for months to get rid of this stuff. There's nothing in those.
leave them the plastic. <laughs> I'll take the rest. Ooh, bit of copper there. I'll take that. And last but not least, the big old monitor, the old CRT monitor. Might have to put that on the front seat, I reckon. Now we'll fit this in too. There's not much in them, but I'll take it anyway. Sit that there. Yeah, I can tie that down like that. Not missing nothing. Oh yeah, take that here. Little motor in there. One more once over. Oh, I think I got it all. Pretty much. So I'll tie that down and we'll get going. Put that in the front. Always leave it tighter than what you found it. Sit that up like that. Arm the camera there. We'll put that on the seat. Like so. First class. Alright, let's unload this. I'll have to process it in another day. Uh. Just get it out of the vehicle for now. Got another job I've got to go to. Or got to go and do around here. To attend to water and all that sort of stuff that's maintained around this place. Check toilets, clean toilets for the following day, that sort of jaga. But anyway, I just got to watch my eyes with this. So I'm only going to load it into this little trolley here. come back to it at a later date. Main thing is we've removed it off their premises so they haven't got it. Um, that's cord food straight out. Throw that that way. if I sit it on top of one another. Turn that. Put that there. Tuck that that way. A little bit of a sort out as I'm going. Well, I know where I'm up to. That can go that way too. There, monitor stand. I might hang on to that back there because I've got that monitor in the front. Picked up a few cans too while I'm being out. That can go that way. Pull that apart at a later date. Another one. Good stuff. Put all my cord stuff over that way. Down there for now. That's probably to that computer that I picked up ages ago. Probably. Still sitting in the shed. 
Here's stainless. Oh, come here, printer. You're bugging me. You're really bugging me. And it's heavy. Got some weight in that one. When they're heavy, that means a lot of things. There's a lot of good scrap in it. Whew. More cord food. Oh, what the ah, oh, that's one of those ink cartridges. I'll put that in the bin. More cord stuff. With TV. Is it a TV or what is it? Might be just a stand or something. I'll find out. This is only a short, short and sweet video for the day. All this is, just a quick one for the afternoon. Be interesting once I start taking it apart. Because they've got some weight in these on how much is actually in them. I know there's stainless steel rods in there. Take that directly over the other way straight out. That's got that bit of copper in it. Even a couple of aluminium heat sinks there. Down there. I think this TV is definitely not going to work. She's a oh Sitting there. And good old CRT TV, NEC. Bit of cool food. That way. That we can go that way too. I've got a special spot for that stuff, that's all. It says I've got water in it. Put that there. And we'll get the other ones out. Out of the front. Picked up more cans. so I'll definitely get around to processing these at a later date don't know when but I've got to get around to it so yeah where's the other one the other good one well I think it's a good one it's a Dell hmm, I've got a cord that can fit that I haven't chopped it off yet hope it's okay Hasn't been banged about or nothing. Yeah. 